my celestial friends! I'm Eka, the Saving Sorceress, and today I'm unboxing and sharing with you a witchy small business haul. I've been wanting to do this for ages. As you may know, I'm usually a thrifter. I tend to thrift almost everything that I have, but there's some things that you just can't thrift and that's where small businesses come in. And when it comes to witchy things, small businesses are key. Cause there's a lot of things you just aren't going to find near you unless you live in like Salem or something. And I've been buying a few things from some small businesses lately, so I thought I would share them all with you. And I also got a special gift from a lovely YouTuber who also has her own small business. So I'm going to unbox that today as well. And it's just, it's gonna be great. I cannot wait to show you all of this. So let's get started. The first small business I bought from is called Sarah D Sewing Shop on Etsy. And she sells these amazing scrunchies. I actually got a few of them and they are all gorgeous. I love the way they look. They're so smooth. They're made of a satin and I feel like it's really good for my hair. So it keeps my curly hair from getting all tangled up. And they're just so beautiful. I mean, look at the colors. I am totally in love with these. Also, she was one of the sweetest sellers ever. She just had great communication. So I highly recommend for all of your scrunchy needs. And yeah, I mean, I feel like this is just particularly enchanting, especially in these jewel tone colors. I love a jewel tone. So I had to share her amazing shop with you. My next find just screams witchy and I love that about it. It is a beautiful wax seal from Fiona Supply Shop on Etsy and it features a moon and some stars and I'm in love. I think it is one of the most gorgeous things that I've ever seen and I've always loved wax seals like this. I don't have very many although eventually I hope to have a small collection but this one was the one that I really really fell in love with. I was like absolutely I need this. I've always been in love with the aesthetic of the wax seal and I'm going to show you some of the seals that I've already made with it. Now, keep in mind, I'm not a huge fan of fire, so while I really, really like the idea of dripping wax to make the wax seals, that's just not me. So, I've got a glue gun that can do it. Did you know that they make wax seal glue gun sticks? There's a few different sizes too, so I recommend checking it out if you want a nice, quick way to make wax seals without, you know, potentially burning your hands in the process. It's pretty cool. And here are some of the seals. I've got a few that are actually just glittery glue gun seals because you can do that too. I've made wax seals before with glue gun and spray paint and they look pretty authentic. That was back before I got the wax in my glue gun, so, you know, options. I also have one that glows in the dark. I think that's pretty cool. And these are the ones that I actually got from the wax seal glue gun itself. I think that they are just absolutely gorgeous and I can't wait to experiment with more wax colors and just put them everywhere. Just everywhere. <laughs> it just, it fills me with delight to think that I can make witchy wax seals now. I'm just over here fulfilling my dreams. And next I've got this mysterious package from the YouTuber Jamila Creates. She has a company called Z As In, and she makes jewelry and fashions. She usually uses secondhand pieces to create magical new fashions. She upcycles a whole lot, which is what I do too, so I really respect the craft. And I just have been really enjoying her channel, so I highly recommend you check her out. She decided to send me a package, and I'm really excited to see what's inside, so let's check it out. Okay, so I've cut it and I've got a note first. Oh my gosh, that has a moon on it. I love moons. <laughs> And she said that she sent me some gifts. She wanted to thank me for supporting her on her YouTube journey. That's so sweet. Well, of course I would support her. She does amazing things and I just, I 
again, I respect what she's doing because we're out here making new things out of old things. And that's just its own kind of magic. I love it. And, oh, she's giving me a little bit of a hint about what's inside, so let me actually go take a look. Well, first, I've got to say, I am in love with the tape. Oh my gosh, holographic tape. It's like, it was made for me. <laughs> okay, I know, I'm getting a little too excited, but like, seriously, I love me some holographics whenever I get them, so... I don't know, is there a way to save tape? <laughs> is that a weird thing to do? I just think it's beautiful. Oh my gosh, it's like actually mostly peeling off. So yeah, I'm totally saving this tape and it's not weird. <laughs> okay, oh my goodness. What is this? Oh my gosh, it's a little bag. It's a little fabric bag that could be hung up Oh my gosh, I think she must have handmade this and it is so good. I might add like a chain and make it a little purse. I will definitely use this again. This is cool. I can't wait to see what's inside. Oh my gosh, it's like a full on Velcro bag. Ooh, hefty, made very well. All right, let's check it out. Oh my goodness, there's a bunch of little, oh my gosh. There's a bunch of little packages in here and they've all got holographic tape on them. <laughs> oh, that is amazing. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay, cool. She made me this. She actually makes a lot of cool little jewelry as well as like different pieces for some of the clothing that she makes. And she made me this moon in this gorgeous blue color. Look at it, it's so cool. It's sort of like a tie-dye look. I like that. That is awesome. I will definitely enjoy this. This is so cool, thank you so much. And there's more in here. So, oh my goodness, I don't, let me get it all out of here so that I don't forget anything. Okay, there's a bunch of little packages, they're all so cute. <laughs> I'm gonna have to rip some of the paper because I can't take all the tape off, you know. Can't save all of it, but at least I've saved some. Okay, this is cute. This is really cute. She's made a little bow. Oh my gosh, I love bows. And it's got little foxes on it. Oh my gosh, that's so awesome. And it's like a pin. I can pin it to things. And the front side is just a nice crisp white and it feels sort of waterproof. I like this, oh my gosh. I'll have just the little secret foxes. Only I can see them. That is amazing. I love it. <laughs> I like, you know, having things that no one else has. That is a totally unique piece. And I just think that's so cool. I mean, it really is the best part about small businesses is that you are usually getting something that no one else has. And that's just, it's an incredible feeling. Oh my gosh, and she made me a pair of moon earrings too that match the necklace. Oh, that's so cool. Oh my gosh, I feel so special that she did this. Oh, thank you so much, Jamila. That is amazing. And I just, I love the creativity. It's awesome. And I've got one more package too. This is like, feels like my birthday. I'm having a lot of fun here. <laughs> Ah. Oh my gosh, she made another little bow. Oh, cool. Wow, this feels interesting too. It feels like it was like, I'm not even sure what it's made from, but it's really unique. Jamila, if you remember how you made these, I would love to hear what you use. This is just, it feels really interesting. I like the colors on it. And I love that I could just, you know, 
pin it to myself, be like, yeah, I'm feeling bow ties today. Oh my gosh, well somebody's definitely been paying attention because I love a good moon, a good holographic, and a good accessory, so thank you so much. That was so kind of you. <laughs> so, so awesome. So make sure to go check out Jamila's channel and her company, Z as in. <sighs> She's doing some really, really creative stuff over there. Etsy and small business websites aren't the only ways that you can shop small. Don't forget about Depop. I have a Depop shop and I love shopping on there in general. And it's a smaller way, definitely, to sell things where you don't have to establish a full business. But a lot of people sell things that they've made or they've upcycled or they've discovered. And that's how I got this little beauty. I was actually buying a whole bunch of things from one seller that most of them will be shown in a future thrift haul, but I wanted to show this off because this beautiful little honeycomb necklace is something that the seller hand makes herself and she sells them on Depop. And I just think it's really cool. I think it's often a slept upon option to think of Depop, but I know how much hard work I put into my own shop, and so I think that someone who's especially selling their own handmade goods, which I occasionally do as well, is worth checking out. And next up is this lovely silk scarf from Love Phoebe Luna on Etsy. I just think it's gorgeous, the colors are stunning, and it may not be the witchiest item, but I do use it to keep my witchy curls in the best shape possible. I wrap up my hair at night in this silk scarf and it just keeps it all nice and safe. So I'm a huge fan, huge fan. I highly recommend Love Phoebe Luna on Etsy. And finally for my grand finale, so you may know that I am a massive fan of Halloween Town, yes that Halloween town from Disney Channel. You know what? It really helped shape me in my formative years. I just, I love it. There's just something about it that is so charming and it's a little ridiculous, but it's beautiful and amazing and wonderful and just so enchanting. What you may not know though is that Kimberly J. Brown, the star of Halloween Town, actually has her own small business on Etsy called Craftily Creative and she makes Halloween Town related merchandise. I've been wanting this shirt for a long time because I just, I had to have something like this. Plus, you'll, you'll see, you'll see. Yeah, it's a rainbow. <laughs> it's like it was made for me. <laughs> it says, being normal is vastly overrated. And I just, I love it. I love it so much. I have been dreaming of this very t-shirt for far too long <laughs> and it makes me feel just so good to finally have it in my hands. Also it's like super soft. It's really really comfortable. So yeah, yeah, things are good, you know things are good. I just love shopping from small businesses. I think it is so amazing and I definitely want to do some more of it. I will probably have to save up some money but I think that's great because I can just spend my time making a list of things that I truly want until I can afford them. And speaking of lists, in the description of this video I'm going to include a few other small businesses that I know of, of fellow YouTubers who make wonderful, beautiful, witchy, and crafty items that I think that you should check out. I'm just so thrilled to be doing this. I think buying small is one of the best ways we can support each other, and I am so happy to be able to do it. So, how about you? Do you know of any witchy or crafty small businesses that you would recommend? Let me know about them down in the comments. And if it's your own small business, I would love to hear about that too. I just think that it is so cool when people are able to make things, create things, and share them with the world. And also, if you enjoyed this video, I would love it if you would add a like and subscribe and stick around for more collecting and thrifting and sewing and fashion and crafting, all with a witchy spin. 
I will be back soon, so stay tuned. And remember, my celestial friends, save whatever beautiful things you can find and shop small. Be kind to yourself and to the universe. And try to add a little bit of magic wherever possible to your corner of the world. Bye. These silk scrunchies are... My next... Oops. Okay.